Alright, so this is the new Pop! OS, the 20.04, and I'm going to be demonstrating its built-in tiling. Now it's pretty interesting because the GNOME environment has notoriously difficult uh, tiling scripts and stuff, so I don't use GNOME myself, but Pop! OS does have a special play in my, a place in my heart. Um, so anyway, let's go ahead and get started. So let's open a file manager on top of here. So you have these two windows just chilling here and to activate tiling you go to the top right corner up here and you click tile windows and that is it okay so now it's automatically tiled now let's see um, so what they also have is you can change the ultimately useless gap sizes um, so you can set those up uh, let's see terminal hotkey is here I believe yeah so when resizing windows, it's nice and smooth. It looks fantastic. I love it. I've always thought GNOME was beautiful, just not the most uh, efficient. But also it, they work as separate containers, so I can resize this one and not have it affect this one too much and stuff like that. So also Vim keybinds are set up stock, so you can move around in the way that is fastest. Now, let's see. So they also have Show Active Hint. What that is is it shows you where your keyboard focus is. So as you can see, it has the orange border around it. So that's pretty nice. I like it. I wish it had mouse follow. But uh, yeah, so also to view all of the shortcuts that they have, you can click on this. And so they have Activate Launcher, um, which is useful. Execute a command in a terminal. That's awesome. Um, execute a command in shell and calculate an equation. I don't know what calculate an equation is, but that's interesting. Um, so yeah, they also have, um, so they have, where is it at? Um, super enter is adjustment mode. So let's see, so shift, okay, so now we're in adjustment mode, now that's highlighted like that, and I accidentally switched desktops here. So as you can see, I'm still kind of a newbie with this. Let's see. And G is to unfloat windows. So, yeah. Anyway, let's go back into this mode and try moving around. That's interesting. Huh. Usually these things get all mad whenever you're using a terminal, but that seems to work out pretty well. Nice. I wish I knew the stock keybinds for pop. But yeah, so it seems to handle all of these containers well. And let me show you the launcher, because I like this a lot. So it's super snappy. Um, even when I was using it on USB, um, I it was instantaneous, so I like whatever they're parsing that with. So, let's see. So nice, yeah. I'm super impressed with this, though. Um, System76 has a special place in my heart. They do a lot of great work. And interestingly enough, uh, Pop! OS was the first non-Slackware distro that I used. And so I love what they do. I wish I had some of their hardware, maybe sometime in the future. But yeah, fantastic company, this is great. I can see this getting implemented into GNOME pretty soon, actually, because it's just it's a little bit wonky still. It did come out today, but um, yeah, it's fantastic. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it, and yeah.